Um, ma'am, you cannot have your block of cheese in the zoo. What do you mean I can't have my block of cheese in the zoo? This is my special cheese. I need this. I need it for shark bite. Ma'am, you're going to have to put the block of cheese away. Ugh. Fine. There. It's away. Are you happy now? Yes, ma'am. Here's your tiki. Ugh. Thank you. All right, we're here at the wildlife park, aka the zoo. You guys like my hat? It's pretty spiffy, right? Are these glasses? And we have the perfect little, little, uh, big stroller for shark bite to be in. Oh my gosh, look at shark bite in the stroller. We're headed to look at some animals today. I'm so excited. And. I still have my block of cheese. Oh, sorry, shark bite. Um, I mean, you know what? You can walk with me. You look pretty cool. I made sure to keep my uh, block of cheese, you know, feed me. Feed me one. Oh, uh, sorry, shark bite. I kind of ate the whole thing. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. Okay, it's, it's whatever. But we're here at the zoo. The zoo snack bar, the souvenir shop. I'm so excited. Let's head over to... Honestly, you normally go to the souvenir shop after you finish going through everything. So let's see what they have at the snack bar. I mean, they wouldn't let me have my block of cheese, which I still had in my pockets. But there may be something in here that we can have. Let's see. Ooh, pizza. They have cookies, sandwiches, donuts. Mmm, ooh, hot dogs and fries, some macaroni, pancakes, and apple pie. <sighs> Milkshakes, they have everything here, but you know, I'm gonna have to go for the good old classic pizza, if you don't mind. Me and Shark Bite over here really love pizza, if you can't tell by the pizza on my back. So, uh, one pizza, please. Uh, ma'am? Ma'am? I think she's sleeping with her eyes open. Okay, well... I'll just help myself. Okay, let me just grab some pizza here. Go ahead and put it in the oven. I guess while we're waiting, we could grab, you know, a milkshake and and drink it a little bit. Don't mind if I do right next to her. Don't worry, I'll pay. Oh, did someone forget to pay the power bill? What happened to the lights? Oh, it's just nighttime. No, we cannot go camping, Shark Bite. We're here at the zoo. We have the pizza. We have... The milkshake that is now gone because I drank it all. But here, since I, I didn't give you any of the cheese, you can have this whole pizza to yourself. And I'll just I'll just take me some hot dogs and fries. How about that? That sounds perfect for me. And you're a little sleepy. I don't know what to do about that. You're gonna have to sleep sleep when we go home. Anyways, let's continue. Oh, this is convenient. There's a bed right here for you, Shark Bite. You can go ahead and sleep in that really quick. Get a nice little nap. And then we'll check out the animals, I promise. Just as long as you don't get stinky. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to wash you in this fountain over here. Uh, of course, of course you need a shower right when I say that. All right, go ahead, get in there. You're stinky, you're thirsty. Gosh, is it really such a bright idea to bring a pet to the zoo with you and you gotta take care of all of their needs? Anyway, shark bite. Look at this fountain right here. It's like a mermaid fountain. That's cool. I don't think there's any mermaids here though. Let's see, what is over here? <gasps> An ancient dragon? Whoa, look how cool that is. That is the coolest ancient dragon I've ever seen. And what about this? Dragon. In some countries, dragons symbolize wealth, power, and leadership. Ooh, this must be the dragon area over here. There's so many dragons in here. There's the normal dragon. That looks so cool. Oh, there's some girl. She looks terrified. Oh, probably because the vampire dragon is right there. Yeah, I'd be a little terrified too if I didn't know about vampire dragons. But they're actually pretty nice. I have one myself. We have the bat dragon. Oh, look at that bat dragon up there. I love the bat dragon. The bat dragon is so cool. You feel sick? Okay, shark bite. How about I, um, I think I'm gonna have to leave you in the care of uh, that guy that was up front. Or you know what? How about this girl? Excuse me. You think you could take care of shark bite for me? Okay, maybe, maybe not. You know what? Shark bite looks fine. Shark bite looks totally fine. We can keep going. 
the lavender dragon. Oh, that is one of the like rarest pets you could get. It was something you got if you had the like radio pack, the DJ pack, I think. I think that's how you got the lavender dragon because it went away. All right, what do we have over here? The lions. A lion roar can be heard up to eight kilometers away. Whoa! Shark bite, you see this? I'm sorry, shark bite. Here, I'll pick you up. You can go ahead and look. Whoa, there's a little baby one in there too. I didn't even see that there. Do not stand on the railing. Um, that is very dangerous, but I am a professional, so I can do it. Rhino. Rhino makes an array of funny noises when they're communicating. Ooh, okay. What kind of, I wonder what kind of noises they make. What kind of noises do you make, Rhinos? Go ahead, make a funny noise. Wow, I mean, I guess that was kind of funny. What did you think about that shark fight? All right, let's see, what's over here? Tiger. Tiger's roar can be heard as far as three kilometers away. So the lion's was, what, eight, six? I don't remember what I read over here. Eight kilometers. And then of course the tiger is three kilometers away. That's pretty cool. That means that lions are a lot louder than tigers. Fun fact, if you didn't know. Wow, look at this guy's face. He must be really enjoying, uh, oh, it looks like the buffaloes. They can run faster than a horse. <gasps> That's insane. Horses run super fast. And to think that there's, I mean, I guess I know there's animals that run faster than buffaloes. But that's super cool. I didn't know that. And over here, we have the golden unicorn. Where is it? Where is it? I don't see it. And the evil unicorn. Okay. Maybe the golden unicorn is hiding somewhere. The frost unicorn. Oh, I see it up there next to the rainbow. Unicorn. Unicorn is Scotland's national Animal? I did not know that. Did you know that, Shark Bite? I did not know that. We have the the normal unicorn up there as well. We have so many unicorns in here, but the golden unicorn, it seems to be hiding somewhere. Um, you know what? That's fine. He's a little shy. All right, let's see. What's in this building? The clownfish. Surprisingly, all clownfishes are born male. <gasps> I didn't know that. That's pretty cool. Look at that clownfish swimming back and forth. What about over here, the goldfish? Goldfish live and sleep with their eyes open? <gasps> Did you guys know that? That's creepy. The jellyfish. Jellyfish don't have brains. <gasps> oh, but look how cool it looks. You know, if we're not having a brain, I think that it's the smartest animal ever. Okay, maybe not. But it looks pretty cool. Stingray. Stingrays have no bones in their bodies? What? What about the little pointy thing that like goes from their eyeballs to the back of them? That's not a bone? Hey, did you know that stingrays don't have bones? Isn't that crazy? Yeah, she's she's in love, well, I guess, with the starfish. She's more of looking at that. A starfish is not a fish. Well, it's, n it's not? That's crazy, I didn't know that. Flying fish. Flying fish aren't capable of powered flight. Um, I guess that kind of makes sense. Uh, I, I don't understand that fully, but yeah, sure. Let's see, the puffer fish. They are the most poisonous fish in the sea. Really? The puffer fishes? I thought it would have been a different fish. That's honestly insane. Beta fish. Beta fish can jump? They can do tricks! Do a trick! Do a trick! I don't know if he's gonna do a trick. All right. Spider crab. These crabs are thought to live to 500 to 100 years? Oh my gosh, Mr. Leggy, you are gonna be around forever. <laughs> Let's see, what's out here? I seen that there was a spot back here. Yes, the elephants. Did you know that elephant elephants can hear through their feet? Ooh, that's interesting. Shark bite has fallen asleep. He's tired of all these animal facts. <laughs> And the panda, they spend a lot of their time day eating. Ooh, I mean, so do I. I love eating pizza all day long. It's the best thing ever. Pizza and cheese, mmm, so yummy. And then we have the unicorns back over there. What's over here? Looks like monkeys and gorillas? Gorilla. Gorilla shares 98.3 of their genetic code with humans. Ooh, interesting. 
This guy is, is completely shocked by that fact, or he's shocked that the albino monkeys are highly sensitive to sunlight, which can damage their skin. Oh, okay. I guess that's why he's chilling, like, under the tree. And then the normal monkey, they are intelligent animals that are good at solving problems. Okay, that makes sense. I think that's all the things around here. Look at them all in there. They look so cool. Look at that one spinning the thing up there. And now Shark Bite is hungry. Shark Bite, you're very needy on this zoo trip. But it's okay. We'll take care of everything when we get home. All right, let's see. Cows. Cows can see almost 360 degrees. No way. They can see all around them. That's kind of creepy. I didn't know that. It's kind of creepy and cool. A horse. Horse can sleep standing up? I mean, so can I. And apparently Shark Bite can too, kind of. Okay, Shark Bite needs a bath. Shark Bite, we'll, we'll go to the fountain soon. I think we're almost done. Let's see. The deer can run up to 35 miles per hour and jump over 30 feet? Oh my gosh, that is some impressive jumping. I can jump like eh, this high. Did you guys see that? Eh. Yeah, that, that's pretty that's pretty high. Sh Sorry, Shark Bite. I'm, I need to set you down. <laughs> Pigs might be smarter than cats and dogs. What? Looks like I'm gonna have to get me a pet pig. Sounds pretty cool. Let's go to the playground, Shark Bite. Really? Ugh. Mm, wait, there's something here. And there's these ones here. Let's go to this one first. Wow. Did you know that the oldest turtle in the world is now 191 years? That's almost as old as me. I'm 100 plus years old. Or is that older than me? Hmm. Frogs use their eyeballs to help them eat. Ew. They use their eyeballs to help them eat? That is so gross. Crocodiles have 66 teeth and can go through over 3,000 teeth in a lifetime? 3,000 teeth? That is insane. Shark bite, did you hear me? Shark bite! Shark bite! Okay. I don't, I don't, shark bite's not waking up. Well, we'll head over to the bird sanctuary anyways. Parrots, they have the ability to imitate human speech. I believe it. I mean, I, I, I don't believe it. I mean, I do believe it because I've seen it before. Owls can rotate their necks 270 degrees. Owls can be so creepy when doing that, but they are kind of cool. Look at that little face over there. Oh, I miss my owl. Bald eagles are believed to live 30 years or longer in the wild. Whoa, and look at him flying up there. Parakeets have as many as 3,000 feathers on their body. That is a lot of feathers. How many feathers does a bald eagle have then? And a parrot, and an owl, and a hawk, which are known for their sense of sight and ability to fly at great heights. Ooh, I wonder if parakeets have more feathers than them. Or the blue jay. They're very intelligent and have an amazing memory. Me, I have an okay memory, I would like to say. This girl has a bird on her shoulder and she looks very uncomfortable, so I'm just, I'm gonna leave you to that. That was everything. We checked out everything at the zoo. Time for the souvenir shop. Ooh, look at this. A dog table, the little cat thing. We got penguins, unicorns. Whoa. Panda plushies and elephant plushies as well. Look at this red panda, the dragon statue, this desk. Whoa, all the cool posters. Sign me up to get 20 of those bad boys. And of course we have some uh, like treasure and stuff. This is cool, I like the souvenir shop. Can I have one of everything shipped to my house? Because I don't think I'm gonna be able to carry all this. Ugh, this guy's sleeping as well. Why was the only person awake was the ticket person? Why is everyone asleep? Anyways, I think now's the perfect time to head home because Shark Bite has so many needs and there's a cool little butterfly behind me, so I'm gonna stand here. But I hope you guys enjoyed going to the zoo with me for the day. I had so much fun and I learned so many new facts. What about you guys? Do you have any animal facts? Leave them in the comments down below. But for now, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye-bye.